So we're out today in central Milton Keynes talking to people about the NHS. People today have been signing this card for us. We've got loads of signatures. Lots of people have decided to come and say thank you and happy birthday to the NHS. They've also told us some of their stories. This was the year that I was born when the NHS was launched and it's been good to me all my life and I hope it continues. Happy birthday NHS. I'm ever so grateful for all the treatment that I got when I was born with a pub foot and uh, I will never forget the quality of life that the NHS has given me, so thank you very much. Happy birthday to the NHS, 70 years young, um, here's the next 70 years. Thank you for always being there when I needed you, when my mum needed you, when my family needs you, when everybody needs you. Thank you very much and happy birthday. So I just want to say happy birthday to the NHS and say a big thank you to all the really hard working staff there. Um, you do amazing work. Um, you've saved people in my family's lives, um, you've saved my life, so I just want to say keep it a fantastic work and here's to many more years and hopefully we can make sure the NHS is well funded going forward. So I want to say happy birthday, happy 70th birthday to the NHS. I've had both my kids through the NHS and also um, NHS workers cared for my nan when um, she sadly passed away in the most dignified and respectful way. A happy 70th birthday to the NHS, the greatest achievement of British politics. If we elect Charlene and Hannah in Milton Keynes and we elect a Jeremy Corbyn-led Labour government, we can protect it for the next 70 years. Happy birthday. Hi, I'm Hannah O'Neill and I'm the Labour parliamentary candidate for Milton Keynes South. And I'm here at our Labour Women's meeting where we've been celebrating 70 years of the NHS uh, and all the great service that NHS is. And we've been hearing today people's stories um, of how the NHS has helped them and supported them. We want to see that continue and it's so important that the NHS is well funded.